Hurricane Helene, a powerful Category 4 storm, churned through the Gulf of Mexico, threatening the Florida coastline. Tallahassee braced for impact, but the storm's path shifted slightly, sparing the city the worst of its fury. While the eyewall, with its devastating winds, missed Tallahassee, the city still felt Helene's impact. Strong winds and heavy rain lashed the area, downing trees and power lines. The storm's outer bands brought significant rainfall, leading to localized flooding. The city held its breath, thankful for the near miss, but aware of the damage left in Helene's wake. The city's infrastructure was tested, and the community rallied together to face the challenges ahead. The near miss served as a stark reminder of the power of nature and the importance of preparation. Hurricane Helene's impact on the Big Bend region was evident in the widespread power outages. Thousands of residents were left without electricity as the storm raged through the night. Taylor, Dixie, and Madison counties experienced near-total blackouts. Leon County, home to Tallahassee, also faced significant outages, impacting tens of thousands of customers. Talquin Electric, the main power provider in the area, reported a substantial number of customers without power. The widespread outages disrupted daily life and posed challenges for emergency responders. Crews worked tirelessly to restore power, but the extent of the damage made the task daunting. The outages underscored the vulnerability of the power grid to extreme weather events. As dawn broke, the full extent of Hurricane Helene's impact became clear. Downed trees littered the streets, blocking roads and hindering access for emergency crews. Debris was scattered everywhere, a testament to the storm's force. The smell of pine filled the air, a mix of fresh scent and the decay of fallen trees. The sound of chainsaws buzzed as crews began the arduous task of clearing the debris. Residents emerged from their homes, surveying the damage and sharing stories of the night's ordeal. The assessment process began, with officials working to determine the extent of the damage and prioritize restoration efforts. The city began the long road to recovery. Amidst the devastation, stories of resilience and community spirit emerged. Donna Parker, a longtime resident of Taylor County, weathered the storm in her home. She recounted the intense winds and rain, but expressed gratitude for being spared the worst. Parker, a seasoned hurricane veteran, had never evacuated her home. She shared stories of past storms, emphasizing the importance of preparedness and community support. Her grandson helped clear fallen trees from their property, a testament to the spirit of helping one another. Her story, and others like it, highlighted the strength and resilience of the community in the face of adversity. The storm brought people together, fostering a sense of unity and shared purpose. Section 5. Restoration Begins a long road ahead. Restoration efforts began immediately following the storm. Crews worked around the clock to clear roads, restore power, and assess the damage. The task was immense, but the city was determined to get back on its feet. The city government provided regular updates to residents, keeping them informed of the progress. Emergency shelters remained open for those displaced by the storm. The focus was on restoring essential services and ensuring the safety of the community. The road to recovery was long, but the city was committed to rebuilding and learning from the experience. The storm served as a reminder of the importance of investing in resilient infrastructure. Section 6. Leon County's Close Call Averted Disaster Leon County, including Tallahassee, narrowly escaped the most destructive part of Hurricane Helene, the eyewall. The eyewall, with its intense winds and torrential rain, would have caused catastrophic damage. The slight shift in the storm's path spared the county from the worst. Emergency Management Director Kevin Peters expressed relief at the averted disaster. While the county still experienced significant impact, the damage was far less than it could have been. The near miss highlighted the unpredictable nature of hurricanes and the importance of preparedness. The county's preparedness and the slight change in the storm's track played crucial roles in minimizing the damage. The experience reinforced the need for continued vigilance and investment in emergency preparedness. Section 7. Emergency Response and Community Cooperation The emergency response to Hurricane Helene was swift and well-coordinated. 
First responders, utility crews, and community volunteers work together to address the immediate needs of those affected. The coordinated effort minimized the impact of the storm and ensured the safety of residents. The county's experience with previous hurricanes proved invaluable in managing the response. Emergency shelters were opened and resources were mobilized quickly. The community rallied together, offering support and assistance to those in need. The collaborative effort demonstrated the strength of the community and the importance of working together during times of crisis. The coordinated response was crucial in mitigating the storm's impact. Section 8. Repair, Recovery, and Preparedness Looking ahead, with the immediate danger past, the focus shifted to repair, recovery, and preparedness. The community came together, united by a common goal of rebuilding and fortifying their homes and neighborhoods. The city and county began the long process of rebuilding damaged infrastructure and assisting residents in their recovery efforts. Volunteers played a crucial role, offering their time and resources to help those in need. The experience with Hurricane Helene served as a valuable lesson in the importance of preparedness. It underscored the need for regular emergency drills and the creation of comprehensive emergency kits for every household. Officials emphasized the need for continued vigilance and preparedness, as the hurricane season was not yet over. They urged the community to stay alert and heed all warnings and advisories. Residents were encouraged to review their emergency plans, stock up on supplies, and ensure that their families were ready for any eventuality. Community workshops were organized to educate and prepare everyone. Staying informed about weather updates was crucial. Residents were advised to keep an eye on weather forecasts, use reliable apps, and listen to emergency radio broadcasts. The focus was on learning from the experience and strengthening the community's resilience. Neighborhood meetings were held to discuss rebuilding strategies and distribute necessary supplies. The recovery process would take time, but the community was determined to rebuild stronger and more prepared for future storms. Collaborative efforts were key to ensuring a resilient future. The experience highlighted the importance of investing in resilient infrastructure and community education. City planners and officials worked tirelessly to implement projects that would safeguard the community against future disasters. Section 9. Hurricane Season Persists a call for continued vigilance. While Hurricane Helene had passed, the hurricane season was far from over. The community had weathered the storm, but the threat of future hurricanes still loomed large on the horizon. The threat of future storms loomed, reminding residents of the importance of continued vigilance and preparedness. Families were encouraged to review their emergency plans and ensure they had all necessary supplies. The experience with Helene served as a stark reminder of the unpredictable nature of hurricanes. The damage left in its wake was a testament to the power of these natural disasters. Officials urged residents to stay informed about weather updates and to have a plan in place in case of another storm. Regularly checking weather forecasts and signing up for emergency alerts were crucial steps. The message was clear. Preparedness is not a one-time event, but an ongoing process. It required constant attention and adaptation to new information and changing conditions. The community needed to remain vigilant and ready to respond to any future threats. This meant not only preparing their homes, but also participating in community drills and workshops. The reminder served as a call to action for residents to take the necessary steps to protect themselves and their families. It was a collective effort that required everyone to be proactive. The focus was on staying informed, prepared, and resilient throughout the remainder of hurricane season. By working together and staying vigilant, the community could face any storm that came their way with confidence and strength. Section 10, Lessons Learned. The Importance of Preparation. Hurricane Helene provided valuable lessons about the importance of preparation. The storm, though not the most devastating, served as a crucial reminder of the unpredictable nature of such natural disasters. The storm's impact, while less severe than it could have been, highlighted the need for individuals, families, and communities to be prepared for any eventuality. It showed that even a less intense hurricane could cause significant disruption and damage. 
the experience underscored the value of having a plan, staying informed, and working together. Families who had emergency plans in place were able to act quickly and efficiently, reducing the potential for harm. The storm served as a wake-up call for those who may have become complacent about hurricane preparedness. It reminded everyone that vigilance and readiness are key to minimizing the impact of such events. It reinforced the message that preparation is not just about surviving the storm, but also about recovering effectively. The aftermath of Helene showed that those who were prepared could return to normalcy much faster. The community's response to Helene demonstrated the power of preparedness and the importance of community resilience. Neighbors helping neighbors and volunteers stepping up showcased the strength of a united community. The lessons learned from Hurricane Helene would undoubtedly shape the community's approach to hurricane preparedness in the years to come. These experiences would lead to better planning and stronger defenses against future storms. The focus was on building a more resilient community prepared to face the challenges of future storms. By investing in stronger infrastructure and continuous training, the community aimed to be better equipped for whatever nature might throw their way.